I need to show you guys another tactic here in order for you to rank faster. One of the most important factor ranking on Google is if you have a fast website. Most of the websites now are using WordPress. And if you know WordPress is using database to query the details that will be displayed in your browser. So that would take the seconds and millions or billions of websites are using WordPress. And one edge that you can do to take advantage ranking factors on Google is to have a fast website. Now, when you have a static website, just like this CMS right here, Grav, this is where you can utilize if you only want to rank for 20 to 30 pages of article, if you're not planning to do like 100 articles, although you can have, you can also do that. But in this way, there is no database, but you can actually maintain your contents pretty easy. I'm going to show you really quick on how you can do this. So the first thing you can do is come over to this site, as you can see here, getgrav.org. Now go to downloads and you will see right here, this is the core file and with the admin area of grav, then you will go to this one, skeletons, because here, when you download the skeletons, it will already have the pre-made themes that you can easily put your contents in and just change the image or whatever you want to update. It's very simple, guys. And it's really helpful if you are just creating 10 to 20 pages, your site will run really fast, which is a great factor for you to rank on Google, especially if you have a good content. So what you need to do is download this uh, with admin option. So let's download this. And you can see here, I chose the option clean black just for this demo, but you can do some, you can also play around with some of the themes right here. Remember, I'm in the skeleton style here. You need to have your web server. Make sure you, your web server can run PHP scripts because the framework is based on Wing and PHP. Here I have the local environments. So what I'll do, I'm going to extract the file. This is going to be the folder when you extract it. So you have to go inside the folder and then cut everything or copy this. Make sure it's in the root directory of your web server or where you need to run your local server. So I'll paste that right there. But you can remove this main folder, you can delete that. And once you have this, go to the URL of your website. Suppose you have, a, let's say in this one, I'm going to create some blogs for this to to demo this CMS right here. So we will be using keyword magic tool in SEMrush and I'm gonna type turntables because turntables sell pretty expensive. So if you want to do Amazon affiliate, you can do that. So let's search for some keywords. And here, once you are in the search result, you can go to questions tab. As usually in questions tab, there are pretty good titles that you can convert as articles. So here you can grab some of the, let's tap some of the keywords here. So for example, I chose these three keywords right here to generate as articles. I'll just generate articles pretty quickly using Article AI Generator. So you can use Claude, OpenAI, or ChatGP to generate your own articles. For this demo, I'm just going to use this to make this uh, demonstration pretty quick. So let's generate these articles with featured image, of course, so that we can see how we can copy and paste those articles in this CMS. So while we're waiting for these articles to be generated, that won't take some time. In one minute, these three will be completed. Now let's open the URL where we save the grab CMS. So it, for instance, this is your website. So in this case, I'm just using my local web server, but in real life, you will have your domain here. So the first time you open, it will ask you to create an admin account. So let's do that. Once you created the account, you will see this very simple interface. So this will be your dashboard. Remember, this won't have any databases. So it loads pretty fast. So the first thing that you can do, go to pages. You can see the structure right here. So the home page, if you see the home page, and if you take a look at the preview, this is how the home page look like. So these will be your recent posts, as you can see right here. And these are all static pages. It, they don't come from any database query. So it really runs fast. This is what Google likes. So now in order for us to add pages here, you can go to home. So here, I, as you can see, I clicked home because this is where the index of my website is. First thing that I would do, I'll go to options or advanced, and you can see right here, the folder name, it's home. So your URL will be, if you notice right here, if you, I go to one of the pages, let's see this one. You, you take this icon right here you can see there are nine sample pages and this blood right here, the urban jungle. If you open this and if you take the preview, open the actual site, 
this is the actual page right here. This is how the blog looks like. And you will notice that it loads really quick because again, it doesn't query from database and you will see the URL path. It's, it's slash home and then the title of your blog right here. So I want to change this home right here because we don't use what they have home and then that path of your actual blog. So settings here in the settings of your home advanced, we change this to blog just like that, something like that, or post, what, whatever you like the path will be, and then click on save. So now, when you go to content, here, go back to pages, and you go to home, and this icon right here, where you can see the nine pages, you will notice that now it's slash, slash blog, slash the urban jungle, so this will become your URL path. Okay, now, in order for us to add pages, we will take this add button right here, to see, click this add, and you will be prompted with this pop up. Now, the page title will be the title of your article. So let's go back to our generated article. So here, the first one will be uh, this how to operate a turntable. You'll see we have the featured image right here. We copy the title, slide that, and then paste the title right here. It will automatically create the path of our site, of our app. Now here, make sure you include that in the home page, and then click on continue. The home page is our parent page. Now click on continue. So you can see right here, this it, the path will be slash blood and then this path right here. Now, the page template, if you notice, we have an option here. So here in the skeleton that we downloaded for blood posts, we have to select M right here and then click on continue. So this will become our editor to add our content right here. So what we need to do, go back to the content. So first, we copy the content right here and then paste that in the editor just like that. And you will see the note here. You cannot add media files unle unless you save the page. So just click save on the top. So we save this page just like that. And we will see this media option where we can drag our image. So go back to your article generated. Save this image right here. So once you save that, we can drag that here just like that. And we can now add the subheading. So because this title right here will become the subheading image. All right. Now we click on save. Let's preview this. If we correctly set this up guys what i notice here in the cms there's a few uh in that that you need to follow to correctly copy the formatting right here because it doesn't copy straightforward when you copy directly using this rich text formatting so come over to this website you'll see right here our rich and text hyphen two hyphen markdown.com so you paste the article that you copied from article ai generator so it will have the formatting right here and then take this one copy markdown clipboard because the cms of this grab accepts markdown formatting so when you paste it right just like this it will be in markdown formatting but when you preview that it will correctly appear the sat formatting that you copied from article ai generator so we save this or we preview the page and you will see right here, we have this nicely formatted article that we have right here. So when you open it to a new tab and you, you will notice it really loads fast because again, this is a static page. They don't come from CMS. You know, the data here, it's not from database. So for us to add image. So again, we click on edit this page. So let's continue editing this page. So I added here, I believe in order for us to add a page. So let's check some of the, how they added the image. So you have to add the uh, uh, image name right here so that it will become the background of our blog post. So let's copy the image name because we already uploaded that to our page, which is right here. You can actually click this icon, metadata icon right here, and you can copy this. Then let's paste it right here. And then we click save. See if it will now view, it will now have the correct view. So usually when you modify something, you go to the dashboard and clear the cache. Because as you know, these CMS save most of the data in a cache. And since this is a static page, the goal of using the CMS is to make our website load really quick. So that's one advantage we can do in order for us to get quick ranking on Google. Again, that is one of the factors where Google comes and calculate the, how they will rank the website. If your website loads faster, then you have a better edge ranking compared to others. And you will see now our background is have been set here. So you can see the background or the featured 
image is now loaded in our blog post and we have this SEO friendly article right here. So again, this is recommended if you want to build and run quickly for the 10, 20 or 30 pages and you want to paste manually the content or you are actually writing your own content not from any uh, AI generator. So you can do this approach if you want to bypass the complexity of installing WordPress and you want to bypass the yet sometimes the slowness of loading the details from the database. So you can have this option too. All right. So you can do that for the rest of these generated articles right here because we generated three. So maybe let's check this. Do I need two turntables? Wait, let's have a look. And you can see this is our nicely featured image and we have this article right here. What you need to do is just copy this. So we come to this website again paste the formatting right here and then once you have the formatting uh, take this icon and now we will be able to copy that to our cms so again we click on pages so we add new page so since it's my my tick board i'll just do some quick title i'll just modify it later and then make sure you choose home and here make sure you choose the page template as item because that's what uh the how the uh, structure of the, your downloaded skeleton from Grav, you can download or you can play around with other things with other skeletons if to see which one fits for your needs. Once you have it here, click on paste, just like that, you have, you will notice that this will paste the markdown formatting. But if you actually preview it, this is how it looks with the actual formatting. All right, now save that. I have to modify the title based on the article title, of course. So copy this. And let's modify this. All right, save that and you had the page. So let's preview it. There you go. You have this nicely formatted SEO article loading in a really fast and yeah, I think speed CMS without any databases. That's about it guys. So if you want to play around again, just download any of the skeletons here and then try and see which one fits for you. This is just a quick video. It's not going through the detail of how we can configure uh, each of this skeleton right here. But again, this is an alternative of WordPress. If you don't want too many complex uh, plugins and you just need to straight away put your contents and start to get cranking. That's about it guys. And hopefully you get something from this one. And if you do, don't forget to leave a like. Thank you and see you on the next one.